Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. You're back with It's Aiden and we're back with a brand new video. Welcome back guys. I've spoken to you guys like about three days ago. Consistency girl, consistency. Anyways, besides the point, so I decided, I was sitting on my bed and I was actually journaling. And I was thinking, what video, what content should, should I do now while I'm at home? Um, and I just sparked my mind a back to school emergency kit. So if you don't know what it is, I'm gonna give you guys just a fast vibe about what it is. So it was like a little baggie where you put everything in that is in a case of an emergency. So maybe your period or you're sick and the school don't have tablets or pads, your friend doesn't have, you don't have this, you want to be clean, you just made an accident, whatever, whatever. This bag will save you. Guys, this bag saved me in my grade 12 year, which was last year. And I only learned about an emergency kit at the beginning of grade 12. So if you know me, or you were my friend in school, then you know that this bag goes with me everywhere. And if you need anything, there is always something in that bag for you. So anyways, this is mainly for the girls. But boys, you are welcome to use this as well. Because sometimes you guys need it more than us. Ah, someone had to say it. Someone just had to say it. So anyways, I don't want to make the intro long. Let's just get into this video. So, yeah. So I decided to change the angle because I just like, yeah, I just like that background. So anyways, guys, this is my emergency kit bag. I got this at Checkers in Inuman City. Um, and I must say, it wasn't really expensive. But you all have to get any size that you like or whatever. But this is just my size. I didn't want it big. I didn't want my backpack to be sick. So I just got the size. And it says little cosmetic bag. So let's get into this bag. Okay, so first of all, I got some pads. I'm gonna take out all of them so I can explain why I have four. Okay, so these are for the heavy flows. You know when you are in the middle of your period and it's just heavy these are for the heavy flows and i think you know this this is the nighttime always pads so these are used when i'm on a heavy flow and yeah that's what i'm gonna say i don't want to get into detail because you guys you guys know me well you we don't know me but we're my besties so we know exactly what we're talking about here so heavy flow and then this is maybe you know your last day you have just that little so this is a thin pad so that's just for the thin pad if you don't want the sick one these are both working for the first day or the last day. Um, if, you, if you're not gonna bleed heavily, but you can choose whether you want to send or sick. I prefer a sick, but I have both just in this. Maybe for someone else or whatever. Okay, this could not fit into my little bag, but I always carry this in my backpack. If you know, you know. These are the Huggies too. These are the Huggies pure wipes. So this, guys, you wanna remove all that old blood. You wanna remove it. You don't want it to mix with the new blood, you don't want that, guys. I'm telling you, and I'm meaning this, and I'm saying this again. When you're in a period, you don't have to sleep. You don't have to have odor. There's gonna be an odor. A metallic one. Metal. Our blood smells and tastes like metal. Literally. If you don't believe me, you can go and search that out. But our blood smells like metal. So you're gonna have a metallic smell. Whatever. That's perfectly fine. That's not mean that you're dirty. But you don't have to smell like food or fish or whatever you don't have to you can maintain your body and you can maintain your healthy so this weight wipes wow well, taking out the old blood whatever just helps you freshen up when you're not in a shower or in a bath like while you're at school or while you're at work or whatever this is your best friend period but then i danced when i was on school so i used to sweat a lot in the dance room or whatever so i needed something to freshen me up so i got this body mist lilac and petals and powder mask so it's from the good stuff and i just needed something whoops, just needed something to freshen me up and this smells actually so nice but i won't use it like now but like it's like it's almost like a bathroom spray it smells like that now not gonna lie, to be honest, that's how it smells like. But it, it, it has a nice scent, but something that you spray on your bed or your curtains. Just saying. <laughs> okay, then I got this country. So guys, my hair is always was always untidy. Not untidy, but it used to like irritate me. Like I don't, I don't like hair being out one strand or whatever. So like I always tie my hair up fast. So a scrunchie, you don't have to have this again. I'm saying some of these things are irrelevant, but it's what I needed. So. Yeah. 
Then, some other one, Lady Sweet Stick. So, the older one. I don't know if you can see that. So, this I used when I was in dance class. So, you know, you sweat and whatever. So, I just use this, like, to freshen up for so you just, you know, you take a wet wipe, you wipe, you wipe, you wipe, like, click them in so the sweat, you don't smell the sweat anymore. Then you just go and you, you put that on so that you smell fresh and then you put on your clothes again and then you go in with a must or whatever, then you won't stink. We want to smell out the until you get home so you can shower and you know, really clean yourself. So, then the most important, well, not most important, but I feel like this is very necessary for all of us girls. This is a normal black underwear, a panty, whatever. Many, many of you girls will say it's a granny panty. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a cotton panty. A cotton black panty. So, this is what you need when you're on your musical cycle. You can't be going to school in G-strings or whatever. You can, it's your preference, but you can't go when you're on your period wearing a pad with a G-string. Your pad is obviously not going to be fitted and your blood will spill and it's, it's just going to be not a nice feeling. You're going to feel very uncomfortable and yeah, you will feel uncomfortable. So, I suggest just getting a black panty with you can fold up so small. Nobody will even know it's a panty. They'll think it's a mask because, you know, it's Corona. <laughs> so, a black panty will help um, in case you have accident at school. Maybe you are wearing a normal panty and you didn't know your 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 um, your cycle is gonna come now. Like it just happens. It's fast and you like boom. I have my periods. What do I do? You have your wipes. You have everything. You clean yourself up. You have your black panties. You have your pants. You put that on. You are fixed until you get home where you can actually clean and wash yourself. So this is my go-to 101, and you can fold it up so small that people don't even know it's a panty. And I have some hand sanitizer from Sorbet. So it's a pandemic and we need to keep ourselves clean and whatever. And then, then, sanitizer. <laughs> the hand sanitizer at school smells like foot. Period. Guys, you can't stray with me. Oh, my school smells like feet. At my mom's school, it smells like feet. Everywhere it smells like feet. I don't know about the private schools. But at my school, it smells like feet. It smells like feet. They're like, oh, fuck, foot. And no, I can't be smelling like that. So, okay, bro. Okay, sorry. Okay, so, you need to get yourself an sanitizer. Sanitizer. And sanitizer. And if you can't, or your neighbors, or someone else, or. It, if you have a friend, a friend that's a share, sharing friend, you ask her for some hand sanitizer. And you have money, you save that money and you go buy your hand sanitizer. A liquor bottle. I don't care what hand sanitizer, as long as you have your own, you make sure it lasts. That's what I have since last year. Okay, last year wasn't that long ago, but I'm in, in the middle of the year. So I have this long. Okay. Then we have some lotion. This is the Nivea. Nourishing guys, some of us be ashy. Sorry, I just need to put it in there. Some of us be ashy at school. Our ankles ain't lotion. Our knees ain't lotion. Guys, I'm not um throwing shade at anyone. Okay, I've been ashy before. But guys, if you have a friend or you are the friend, just use the lotion. Be like, my hands is so ashy right now. You want some? Be that friend. Don't be a no, my lotion's almost up for him. Be a, you want some friend. Be that friend. Okay? Again, I don't know anyone's financial situation, so we are not, we're, not, we're not all fortunate to have lotion or whatever, but if you do have, share, give. This is an emergency. Maybe you fell on the floor, or maybe you were scraping on, again, me, I'm a dancer. I dance on the floor, on my knees, on my ankles, it gets scruff, it gets ashy, and I need lotion. So, this might be relevant to you or not, but for me it is. If you smoke at school, no? Yeah? And the is not helping alone. Lotion! Gone. The smoke smell is gone. No? Yeah? So, nobody has to say, um, post no more anymore because you have lotion, you smell good, everything. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Then I have, um, new different pills. This is for the menstrual cycle. Um, if you have a baby, 
heavy stomach cramps this while or I already take Panada because I feel like it's too weak for me normally I take Atkadol but I can't take Atkadol at school because it will make me sleep so I take Atkadol when I'm at home and when I'm at school I take Nurofen Nurofen doesn't always help for everybody but it does help for me and you know the school spiller uh uh that's good to keep Panada which that one's help actually better than the normal Panada so anyways if that's also a choice if you want to you don't have to yeah and then, if you know me, you know, how did I not know that I had a fucking close one here in? Okay, if you know me, you know me, you know that I always have bubble gum. Always. When I tell you I don't have, it's because I don't want to give you. But I always have. And this is the Orbit Spearmint Flavored Chewing Gum. Guys, it's my best friend. I have braces, I need to make extra care, I need to take extra care of brushing my teeth, making sure that I, it doesn't stink because I am up in everyone's faces. I was talking. So, I need to make sure my braces is right. Okay? So, you don't only chew bubble gum, make sure you brush your teeth twice a day. Morning, night. Eat your gum afterwards. Rinse your mouth after you eat heavy foods. So I have braces, so I need to make sure nothing is stuck or whatever because uh, it's embarrassing sometimes. So again, chewing gum. And if you're that friend that always has, give. But if if people ask for too much, don't give. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Because this is expensive. 22 ren, I bought for me. 22 ren. No. But anyway. Gum. Oops, yes, gum. And then lastly, my lip balm, Vaseline, Cocoa Butter, focus brah, focus, yeah, Vaseline, Cocoa Butter, okay, I can't open this right now because my knees are like of the lotion, but you need to always make sure your lips are, you know, moisturized. One thing I forgot to add in here is a mask, sorry guys, a mask. Always need to make sure you have an extra mask because anything can happen, especially if you're wearing that surgical ones around your ear, it can break, it can whatever. So make sure that you have another one in case of anything. So, anyways, that's the end of it. Not so much, just the important things that I needed. I hope this helps you. Um, I didn't want to make it too unnecessary. I wanted, I wanted to keep it the basics, but I didn't want to take out what I needed because maybe this people that's in the same boat as me and also need these things so you know what i mean so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys on our next video love you besties